Authorities in Texas are investigating the shooting deaths of a county district attorney and his wife. Mike McClelland was DA of Kaufman County in North Texas. Police say the deaths could be linked to another killing. Just two months ago, one of McClelland's top prosecutors was also gunned down. Louise Martin is on the story and joins us now with more. So, Louise, what do we know about this latest killing? Well, police say a 63-year-old Mike McClellan seen here uh, was shot several times in his home with an assault weapon. His wife was shot once. This is the crime scene outside their home as their bodies were uh, found yesterday. Now, it is believed there are some fears, I should say, that these deaths are linked to another killing. As you mentioned, Nancy, the murder of another key prosecutor in McClellan's office. The discovery of their bodies, uh, McClellan and his wife, come two months to the day that DA Mark Hasse was gunned down outside the county courthouse. He was gunned down in broad daylight. No arrests have been made in that case or in this case. But after Hasse's murder, uh, focus really turned to a white supremacist group known as the Aryan Brotherhood. At the time, McClellan made some bold statements about whomever was responsible for his colleague Mike Hasse's death. And uh, here's a clip of him with some of his more outspoken comments at the time after his colleague was gunned down. Uh, when you deal with bad people uh, on a regular basis, uh, you know that there's always the potential for these bad people to do something bad to you. He went on to say after that that uh, we're going to find you, we're going to pull you out of the hole you're hiding in and prosecute you to the fullest extent of the law. And some believe that because of his outspoken uh, comments about his colleague's death and who was responsible, that he may become the next target within that office, Nancy. Wow, pretty frightening stuff. Mm -hmm. So where exactly are police in their investigation, Louise? Well, local authorities are also working with the FBI, Texas Rangers, uh, trying to under un uncover who is responsible for Hassey's death and now investigating that. That possible link between his death and Mike McClellan and his wife. Now there was also a shooting uh, two weeks ago in the town of Monument, Colorado. That's when Colorado's prison's chief was gunned down at his home. The suspect there, a member of the white supremacist 211 prison gang, was actually killed by police. At this point police have found no connection but they were investigating whether they, there was a connection there. Uh, so Nancy, this just all has uh, too many similarities, say police, so they are certainly looking at the allegations that it could could be the same person or the same group responsible for these deaths. Okay, good to know. Thanks, Louise. My pleasure.